It's time we have to be heard. Let's stand together. The world, she has to be heard. It's time we need to be heard. Let's stand together. The people, we need to be heard. Rise up against the hoax. Let's fight together. Rise up. This is not a joke. Fight the fight with me. I feel strong. So hold on, hold on, hold on to me. We're not alone. We're fine. Stand up, the world is on fire. Let's take together. Stand up, we need to be seen. Stand up, the world is on fire. Let's stick together. Stand up, we need to be seen. And I know that, and I'm ready for that, and I'm ready to do and I and I'm open to bleeding. And, and a good fight ain't never hurt nobody. Okay? Um Real talk, you live, you know what I mean? You, you, shit, you wake up and you can laugh about it. <laughs> yeah, niggas scared to get knocked out. Niggas scared to get they hurt, their feelings hurt. But you know what I mean? It's like I'm ready for that. But it's like then um, you want to, you know, you want to internally affect a nigga. You want to try to sneakily use themselves against them in a, you know in a sort of I don't want to say mental it's like an emotional sort of psychological just toying sort of just even just like irritational just just to try to get on a nigga nerves really you know what I mean you want to get on a nigga nerves you know I'm ready to bleed but you want to get on my nerves though right not to not say that I would rather be bleeding what I'm saying is um, what is it really? What is it? What is it that you're trying to prove? Like, what is people trying to prove that they can keep, that there ain't no God going to stop them immediately? That's not the point. That's not how God operate, yo. Because lightning? Because what? Comets? Because what? <laughs> bombs? Oh, because of bombs. That's not God at work yo that's man challenging God that's man testing God that's man teasing God teasing our creator for giving us the time not to have to drop an instant bomb teasing the natural order teasing the holistic sort of organic process and cycles of life so just because I ain't got a bomb and I and dislike you enough or don't prefer how you acting enough to press a button on your ass, nigga, don't mean that you clear to cross a line to have any type of thought in your mind about me. Simply put, like, even aside from you tampering or uh, what is it called? You know what I'm saying? You damaging or interfering with a nigga's property or, pro or fucking operation or uh, physically. I don't have no words for this shit. Like, I don't just fuck. You already know what it is. Like, as far as like physically, what is it? Uh, threatening a person? Yeah, I guess the word would be threatening. Like, fuck out of here, man. Whether it's emotionally, mentally, physically threatening people, whether it's, you know, thinking about them at all, man, it's still a threat. It still has an effect. Like I, like I had said, yo, they keep it always 700 million percent with you yo and i'm gonna try to keep it lighthearted. and look I, i'm not here to entertain you i'm here to invigorate you right not to to uh enrage you <laughs> i'm not here to infuriate you i'm here to invigorate you okay the truth the truth is power power okay the truth is freedom 
Freedom Freedom is truth. Okay? It's truth. So if you first of all, if you are sensitive, or if you if you are so sensitive, if you are small minded enough, if you are petty enough to find offense in, in any tone that I may present something, then this message is not for you. It is, but whenever you're ready, it is. Okay. Whenever you're ready, it's for it's for when it's for you, and and the the part of you that will be ready or is ready, aside from whatever part of you that isn't or won't ever be, is not for me to say. For one, secondly, as I am saying what I'm saying, if you are hearing it, even even if you find offense in it in whatever sort of anything related to it, part of what I'm saying will resonate. All you have to do is is hear what I'm saying and it'll make sense when it needs to make sense. You know what I'm saying? Because as you grow, as you change, because change is change and growth is growth. You can change for the worse or the better. The change is is inevitable. Change is happening even in whatever is set in stone is still, you know, always different in every instant, right? So as you change, what I said will stay the same. Right? And that you heard it and that, I sound, that I'm saying it on record. Which was, the, which was the first point of reference, the first offering, the first mention. In the onset, in the inception of this particular project, related to sound, related to syllables of sound, which are increments, which are, there are seven tones. You are not going to say anything that is not mathematically structured to begin with. Right now, our association as to where these sounds, these this this range of um, levels of sounds, of frequencies that we can create using our organic fucking configurations, that is our throw box and shit. Um, our association as to the connections as far as the functionality and even how I can even be saying anything. I can't say a E before a V before a X because how the fuck would you pronounce that? X? Is? And what word is that? It's not really a word. However, not in English it ain't. I don't know what I just said, nigga, in, in, nigga, in, in Finian, in Finnish language. I don't know what I just said. Just, but just because I don't know what I said don't mean that I did not say anything, right? But for me to know that I am saying something and to know what it is I'm saying, or at least be sure or have something that I am saying, it would help me be able to describe and explain in the different ranges or different fucking categories or different uh, plethora of languages and you know version the different versions of what i'm saying translation translation the different versions right translation however even up to will we even get the sound qualities the inflections you know what i mean the the the, the vowel families and the vowel groups which there's what how many vowels six Sometimes why? If you add the why, right? And then we might even have a seven vowel. I'm sure we do. I'm sure we have more than even those vowels. But those are the vowels that we are been associated with because that's the, you know what I mean? That's the codex, the collected uh, fucking corpus that we have from just, just one main, you know, saturated area of nigga cognitively structured communication, okay? But there was cognitively structured communication happening and that we have libraries of literature from my nigga that is not exposed to the public my nigga that's literally under wraps bro alphabets before hebrew my nigga that are locked in a vault my nigga that you cannot see even with money my nigga So as far as resonating with you at a 
later, fucking opportune alternate time <laughs> in your life of reflection <laughs> and recollection, you hear me. All right. Whether you feel me or smell me or not. <laughs> the point of what I'm saying to you before I forget it. Um, was, of course, about motherfucking, um, you talking all that shit for nothing when it's been, you know, purposeful, your thoughts, purposeful, your thoughts, and thinking of other people, basically, was the point that I had said in another piece about the very thought of a person is alive, yo, your imagination is living, for one, whatever image you hold in your mind, first of all, thoughts, held in mind, create after their own kind. Okay, that means your dreams, your imagination is living, for one. Everything you've ever seen, first of all, you're only going to imagine in reference to what you've already exposed your mind to. That is why the, the, the further even importance of innovating. Of, of being imaginative, you know, stretching your imagination. That's what stretching your imagination means, meaning that you're taking everything that you even have accepted as possible and challenging it in your most creative way. And that takes not even so much thinking, just trust in the unknown. Right? your consideration of what would be unknown. Because even if you know it to be unknown, you're limiting it. Your consideration of what would be unknown. Because even if you know it to be unknown, you're limiting it. Be unknowable. Be unknowable or unknowable. Right? But if you're sitting up thinking about another person, shh. Man, I'm going to go ahead and snatch your thoughts from you, girl. Let me, let me have them thoughts, girl. You feel me? Because I'm, you know, I'm already thinking about 20 million things at once. You don't need your brain, bro. Let me use your brain, bro. <laughs> Fuck you looking at me for, my nigga. So you can call the police when I smack you? You bored? Really? Don't be bored, man. All right? Go look at her, brother. I'm already not looking at you, bro. So if you like looking at people that's not looking at you, you should be looking at her. And what's funny is like, you know what I'm saying? If she should happen to look at you, whether you're looking at her or not, and you want to look at her, then it won't be an issue. Like she won't smack you in your motherfucking mouth like I'm gonna smack you in your mouth for looking at me too long. Which if she don't want you to look at her, then you probably don't want to look at her for too long. Because that has an effect on your karma, is what I'm saying to you. You may not care because life is fucked up anyway and you got enough good karma because you do good things enough. However, man, you know, that scale is, is interesting. It's an intricate scale. It's not based on, you know what I'm saying, just, you know, hard facts all the time and numbers, brother. You feel me? Because a one can be a hundred. Depending on the concentration, depending on, you know what I'm saying, the ratio of, you know what I mean, the language, the fucking codex and shit, you know what I'm saying, the assignment of sounds and shit for one, man. <laughs> you playing. <laughs> that one can be related, however many other many people you've, however many other fucking lives and, you know what I mean, images of outside of yourself you've included with that one. Makes that one heavy, or it's still one, but is it a one kilometer or a one millimeter? You feel me? It's still a one, yes? Well, shit, brother. You, you feel me? I mean, maybe you got, you good, you might be safe. But you don't ever, you know, you don't want to ever take no chances on that just unnecessarily, because you never know. Like, you might fuck up and do some shit that you didn't expect to do, or you might make a mistake, and then the one mistake, because you was, you know, just doing. You was trying to get away with as much as you could without having to call the police on a nigga for whooping your ass. You feel me? They come enforce some shit that you are instigating between you and another person. Um, 
Which is so weird to me. I'm not like trying to say, oh, well, you can't beat me up. Then you, you don't need to be trying to, you acting like I won't beat you up. My nigga, like, I'm not saying all of that, but what are you really saying? Is what I'm saying to you. Like, what are you saying? You have time not to be focused on your purpose. You don't. And even if you do, you still don't. You honestly don't, bro. And whatever time you, you're wasting that you're not taking, if you ain't taking your time, then you're wasting your time. If you ain't taking your time, then you're wasting your time. So I understand anything about instant, and you know what I mean? And, you know, doing it all at once. However, any of it that you're not doing that you can be doing is just that much more of what you have done that it, it affects what you have done and also what you haven't done. At, you know what I mean? What you don't do. Everything you do affects everybody else and what they do. You know what I mean? Even if you know them or not, whether you've met them or you can see them or they're going to whoop your ass for looking at them for too long or not. Or, you know, are they going to, you know, show their discontent or, or dissatisfaction with whatever it is they are interpreting, you are projecting towards them, you know, in, in the thought of them, the image of them, whether they're going to outwardly express that or, you know, have a own inner thought to themselves that is not the most, you know, productive and progressive and you know what I mean? Positive as well as enriching or necessary. Uh, you know, that's on them, I guess you could say. Uh, but why would you want, you know what I mean? It's like, it's like, I don't know. It's weird because it's like, you know, you want me to be thinking about you and not even just thinking about you, but, you know, thinking, you know what I'm saying? Like having to hate you basically you want me to hate you right and it's, there's a lot of reason behind that there's a lot of reason behind that it's not like you know you know we just be feeding on hate nowadays hate is a real thing you know it's, that's why i be feeling like hate is unnatural because it's like it's so it's so the thing like i don't even i don't think it's natural like you know everything is for a reason but then the reason behind it is basically to 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 remind you to challenge to challenge your you know, your integrity, your, uh, you know, your resolve to challenge your loyalty to truth, your loyalty to honor is what it's, it's, it's what hate is for. Yeah. It's to challenge your loyalty to honor, you know what I mean? Cause it's this, you know what I mean? It's not, it's, you know what I mean? It's embarrassing. It's, uh, petty and unnecessary to react um, you know what I mean? In any way that it does, that's not universally uh, neutralizing, right? However, when you showing other people that um, you can do what you want to do and get away with it, that's that's fucking retarded. Like, why would you do something like that? Like, even if I'm doing something and getting away with it. I would imagine that anyone would not even be, would not even notice that. Especially if it's not nothing that, that it would even make a difference in your life. Like, why would they even notice it? Like, why? It's like you're judging people. Like, niggas be judging people. Like, that's what it is. And why do you judge people? As if you will not be judged. That's weird to me, yo. Right, like I always learn. I was always told never judge a person. I, I would never judge you anyway because it's like, yeah, just because you did some shit that I don't think was good, you can do something that I do think is good. You probably just did something that I felt that I liked just before that made me even feel like I care enough about what you ain't doing. What if I don't even know you if I don't like you? What if I don't even know you? If I don't like you, <laughs> why the fuck would I even notice anything you're doing, my nigga, if I don't like you, cuz? And I don't even have to be around you, cuz? Enough to judge what you are or not or aren't doing? That shit is weird, my nigga. And even if you have to be around somebody that you probably would not necessarily, it's not your style of person, it's not necessarily like how you like to get down or whatever, you can just as easily not think about that, my nigga. 
you got to be careful, okay? You need, to, you need to figure out what it is that you're doing. Like, what really are you saying, okay? Get over it? It's not about me, my nigga. Because, see, this is the point of what I'm saying, and I said it already. I'm going to say it one more time. My image is not what you think it is. But thinking of it does not change what it is, in fact, is, my nigga. And that has its own power in it, bro. And so, out of compassion, okay, out of solidarity, out of humble fucking empathy, my nigga, out of, out of uh, concerted and, and, and distinct discernment as well as foresight I operate in a specifically structured manner my nigga right to where there's no reason there's no excuse for anyone having anything to say whatsoever unless there's something wrong with you in addition to what is already really wrong with you. Because we all have something wrong with us, but we have those things that are wrong with us already without you including anyone else, my nigga. You already have something wrong with you. I already have something to, 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 to twerk out, okay? To tweak up within me just being born to the family I'm born to, you know what I mean? Going to, and, and having the fucking rearing that I've had, the cultivation into this manifestation of this very, very moment. And so the thought of that is what it is in reality, you know, in, in all the truths and the relatable understandings and approaches and interpretations of the full universal truth is what it is when it comes to me, my soul, my name, my actions and thoughts, movements, destiny, legacy, interests, you know, preferences, okay? Likes, dislikes, you know what I mean? Reactions and, and uh, all that. It is what it is. It is what it's going to be. What you think about it, nah, don't change it, you know, what, what, what I would say about what you are doing to me or in respects to the thought of me, no, I guess, you know, it's not so significant. Um, so what is it that, so why you feel like it's something that you want to, you know what I mean, that you want to even involve yourself? And that's the point, like, it's a reason why. And that reason is, that matters. That reason matters more than you realize because see, if it wasn't a reason, and if the reason is just that expendable, then that's not nothing even that you would, would, would hold your attention, to be honest. Right? So it's bigger than that. And like, you know, deep side, deep down, you already know that it is. And you already know all that it's connected to. So I'm just reminding you of all that it's connected to. Because all that it's connected to deserves you to realize your contribution to realize, you know, your, your, your position, your role. And, and you deserve that as well. Right. Am I going to help you get it? That's how I operate in my life. I already have done that in anything that I've ever done. My nigga. Trust me. You may not understand it now, but once you do, you know, you still got all those good things to focus on. So as far as the image of a person, right? And when you think about a person, um, it, it literally affects the, the the grid, the structured grid of life. You know, it's called the luminous energy field, okay? Shamans from every culture, uh, including Native American, uh, you know, as far as just the focus on indigenous people, and indigenous healers and medicine gurus, they refer to this, this dimension, this fucking oral, fucking etheric net as the luminous energy field, my nigga. So that luminous energy field is consciousness itself, right? 
but it's the different degrees and levels of consciousness and the different portals as well as planes of interaction with consciousness which is energy yes what is energy energy of course is invisible unless of course it is visible energy and what other visible energy is there other than light light in itself is the visible energy like okay well of course you got electricity but the only reason you could see electricity is because of the light that is generating yes because you got radioactive waves you can't see them you got x-rays you can't see them you got infrared beams that's energy and that's also light energy in fact all energy is light in fact all energy is light okay you have invisible light if all energy is light, but everything ain't lit, okay, that means you got invisible light, yeah? So what makes light visible, hmm? Huh? There's your interaction with it on a particular plane in the luminous energy field, which your thoughts are now infiltrating, is now what do you call it? You know what I mean? Contributing to is now, what is it? Not activating, but like if you were to plug something up into a fucking socket, that's what you're doing when you're thinking. Right? And what's the socket? That luminous energy field is the socket. What's the plug? Your thoughts. Okay, what happens? Oh, shit, man, you might, you, know, you might break your circuit fucking around. Plugging into the wrong socket when it comes to that luminous energy field. Right? Because my, my wiring is a bit sort of, you know what I mean? Intricate. My my wiring is intricate. It's it's custom. I have custom wiring me personally for a different sort of voltage experience. My, you know what I mean? As far as like a workflow, my whole my whole flow is on some other shit. Like it's it's custom made, bro. You know? Like it's it's custom made, bro. You know what I mean? You ever you ever have like a fucking uh, mechanist, a machinist who who builds their own fucking station and shit. Like you ain't finna just go press no, you ain't finna go press no buttons at the, at the mechanist fucking, you know what I'm saying? Quantum scientist fucking lab and shit. You need to stay the fuck from out of there, homie. You need to stay the fuck from up from out of there, my G. Unless you invite it, my nigga. Real talk. Cause it's hazard, it's hazardous materials. Okay. That's all I'm saying to you. And that just go from it for anybody, especially you don't know them. It's like you can't just be doing dumb shit for nothing. Like, what's wrong with you? It matters, my nigga. It really do. To all thoughts in, in general, that you're not utilizing your thoughts, that you're not, you know what I'm saying, advancing your thoughts. I'm not talking about be walking around trying to be philosophical. I'm saying you have your consciousness for a reason and it's not for you to use against yourself. And considering anything that is not serving your desire as well as interest, my nigga. Let alone for you to involve any anything outside of yourself like the thought of another person, my nigga. So hopefully that you hear that and it don't make you feel, you know, insecure because you didn't say it or, you know, you ain't any you can't compare to whatever it is that you want to fucking um how the image of me that you equate <laughs> look homie just keep it all the way raw you know what I mean and do your do your thing you know what I mean do your thing and it ain't shit it ain't, ain't no comparison to your thing that's the whole that's another whole point too so it's like don't feel like a nigga won't smack in your mouth money it's not about that I don't want to smack nobody bro I, I don't want nobody using me as an excuse to now exploit energy to exploit light just because I'm there when I'm finna be there okay I'm everywhere I don't know it's just kind of weird to me that's the point I want to make or that's what I want to say about that I was thinking about um you know I had I was thinking about something I was writing something and I had to you know had a, had a thought while I was writing some shit Ay, ay, ay. Anyway. Thank you for your thoughts of me. And to twisted thoughts, things be twisted, you know, when you consider things to be twisted. And I know it's like connected to other things. Like if you didn't care, then you wouldn't even, you know, it wouldn't, if you did not care, then you wouldn't care. You know, it's something that you're caring about. 
that got you feeling however you're feeling. Call and response Q&A. Question, question and answer. New dimension. Essential aspects of life. Health. Health. Action. Action. Art. Art. Family. Family. Culture. Culture. Heritage. Breathing. 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 Diet. Diet. Exercise. Exercise. Rhythm. 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 Motion. Motion. This is is what scientists will consider a paradigm shift. The tipping point. The tipping point. We are. We are. We are on on a sojourn. sojourn. On a sojourn. At the onset. At the onset. The Plymouth. The Plymouths. The Zenith. Horizon. Horizon. Meridian. Meridian. On the outskirts. Of the very of the very ridge of the ledge of the, of the, ledge, ledge, of the edge, faced with the arrival of evolution, forced and faced in human consciousness with an arrival of evolution, human consciousness, human consciousness, a reconstruction, a reconstruction, a reconstruction of awareness, the divine, divine designation of this new dimension, new dimension. Next dimension. a next dimension, next dimension. Another, level. another level, another level of seeing. Uh, Another level, Another level of being, of being, thinking, thinking, living, the enhancing, the enhancing advancement, advancement of reality. Reality. reality, reality, most probably, probably believe probably in the possibility of many realities, many realities, several conclusions, the applicability of the general individual may argue, may argue that reality is relative, reality is that relative. there very well exists everyone with their own truths. Truth. The Zen enthusiasts might, enthusiast might insist in the principle of a one universally natural, natural and inclusively exclusively supreme, supreme and supremely absolute and absolutely, and absolutely true, 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 true. What are the others saying? What are others saying that another ain't? That another ain't? How do these two relate? To relate? And where originates? And where originates the, the dichotomy? Bridging, bridging the debate. The debate today. Today we explore today life. We explore, evaluate, 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 examine, 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 investigate, investigate life, investigate life as we know it, life as we know it, life as a whole. Life as a whole.